on me though, but that's a good little crap there. It's good for bait. Alright guys, this is the next day, the next morning. We got the redfish, put the tag on it of course. We're gonna go ahead and uh, fillet this bad boy up. I got my brother's nice Damascus steel kitchen knife. Alright. Right here we got the belly meat with the ribs intact. Check that out. Beautiful piece of redfish. Now some people they go and cut out these uh, lateral lines here. And they go further out and process that there. But we're going to package these the way they are and let uh, my brother and my other brother and my, my pops here, my mom, they're all going to get a piece. And they can prepare it how they want. You get them inside? The inside? To his teeth, sure, show those teeth, man. So I don't know if you guys know drum, they got teeth, man, but look at them, check them out. They got little teeth on them. See that? Tap the screen so you can see. Can you see? Yes, sir. Don't go too close, because uh, I think it uh, will get blurry. So look at these teeth on it, guys. Look at that, they got a bunch of them. Down here in the bottom, it's like, right here in the bottom, it's like catfish. Up here in the top, it's more, they're sharper up here. That's cool. All right, there you go. All right, guys, so we're done here cleaning this fish. We're going to get in, uh, clean up the area here and get these boys uh, packaged up. We're going to start off with the head. Get this bad boy in here. Oh, you got to look at all the meat in there first off. People, a lot of people are going to throw that away, but why? I think my mom has something that she's going to do something with that soup or something. I don't know. I would, ro I would roast it in the oven first. That would be kind of cool. That bad boy in there like that. Did I get it? Did I get it? What do you think pops about the whole? Uh, I think it's badass, yesterday. but I think. <laughs> Can't wait to taste them. Hey you guys man, uh, we appreciate you watching and I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the whole uh, catch and clean and uh, you know prepare. But uh, like, subscribe, and uh, please leave a comment. You know, there's a lot of things that I, I, I could have did. I could have had that net with me. I could have had that fish grip with me and uh, other stuff like that. But either way, it was fun. You know, to all the youngsters out there, I apologize about my language and everything. You know what I mean? But, you know, one, man lyric, one man's lyric is another man's insult, whatever, all that junk. I appreciate you guys, man. Thank you for all my new subscribers. And stay tuned. Watch Oscar George, you guys. All right, you guys. So right here we got the uh, 
the 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 red the red drum, the red fish, uh, blackened. My brother, he's gonna have to tell you that himself. The secret ingredients, this, that, and the third. Secret. But a lot of people here, we haven't even tasted this fish yet. So we prepared a pe a portion of it for everybody to taste. And this guy did the, 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 the good work on that bad boy. So let's cut that, can you show us the texture and, and, and flakiness of your fish, dude? Okay, so let's go right down the middle. Right. <laughs> you see that pinkness in there? That's okay because saltwater fish can be eaten raw. And when you sear salmon, and you, when you sear uh, uh, a tuna, you get that cooked area right here. And you have that nice pink area in the center right there. All right, now everyone's here trying the redfish for the first time, man. All right, Uncle, you let me know what you think. Oh, let me get a close up. Show me that texture. Oh man, it's too God hot. dang, smoky. Yeah, so good at all of us. Left your grandma. That's what I'm talking about. What do you think? Oh, it's like my milk. How does it taste? Not too good. Look at that. Beautiful. You give me a spoon or something. All right. Yeah. All right, Ralph. Try a piece and let me know what you think, man. Try to, try to, try. Uh, I got my brother Ralph here. You gonna try a piece? Just fry for the fry fry. Is this fried? Is it a bit? Is this fried? Yes, pan fry with olive oil and a little bit of butter. Can you give me about some good texture? Yeah? I give it a 1 out of 10. Uh, I give it a fucking 8.8, .8, dude. No shit. That's not exactly what I was thinking, man. 8.8. .8. Wow. Okay, Jazz. You need Oscar? I will. Well, you, about eight eight, dude. you let me know what you think. I'll tell you what. That's an eight. Huh? Right? That's good. All right. Go ahead, baby. Katrina right here. A little bitty there in the bottom. There's all my rings are. And you tasted a lot of my different fish, right? So compared to all the other ones, what do you think? I don't know, I give it a seven. Seven? All right, get out of here, seven. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> Jet, uh, Esby, come over here. Let me know what you think. You get yourself a nice big piece of that saltwater fish. We caught this at Port Aransas. It's just tender. Put that's the fucking right. bay to the plate. Mm. <laughs> well, <laughs> right? Hey, high five. Cat, you give it a seven because cat likes catfish and stuff like that, right? Tilapia. What do you give it? I think it's 8.8. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Let, let me try a piece right here. If you remember, it was orange or something. Orange. Yep. Right here. You didn't give me water? I don't know. Oh, you got to try the fish. Okay. I love to make it. 1 to 10. <laughs> Bro, I said 818. I told you. I told you. Nobody believed me. 